safety of airliners has come into question after a number of phones and other devices with lithium-ion batteries have caught fire. Well, now some airlines are adopting new emergency equipment, and Chris Van Cleve gives us an early look. This demonstration shows what happens when a flaming laptop with a lithium-ion battery is put in a fire-resistant bag. Open the bag. Fireproof gloves are stored within the bag. Down the gloves. Thomas Conley's company makes the hot stop. Inside, several heat-resistant materials, including one that can withstand temperatures up to 3,200 degrees. It will explode. There will be noise. There will be boom. But it's going to be within this bag. Could blow up like a beach ball, but it's going to be contained. And that's the key. So it's layer after layer of... Fireproof components. Fireproof components holding that to let it burn itself out. We had a sales device that kind of exploded, caught on fire. After a credit card reader overheated on this Alaska Airlines flight a year ago, the airline joined Virgin America in putting the containment bags on all planes. And following the FAA ban of Samsung Note 7 devices like this one that started smoking on a flight earlier this month, Delta and other carriers are now looking at the technology. Andy Schneider is Alaska's vice president of in-flight services. Once a battery starts to implode on itself, it continues until all of the chemical has run out. And so it does take a lot of liquid in order to make sure that we try to reduce the heat. They burn very hot and they burn very fast and it can be for quite a long period of time. But the Federal Aviation Administration has concerns about the bags, warning in a 2009 safety alert, transferring a burning appliance into a burn bag may be extremely hazardous. Regulators say airline crews should avoid touching a burning device and instead try to put out the fire with water or a chemical fire suppressant. Alaska trains its crews to first douse a flaming device per FAA recommendations and then put it into the containment bag. Scott, that bag is then put in a bathroom away from passengers to give pilots time to safely land. Chris Van Cleve for us tonight. Chris, thank you.